I ain't got much time today because I got that damn farmer's market this afternoon. So I got to make the most of what little bit of time I have. It's a shade after 8 now. Tide's low at 11. And we got some company coming. We'll see how it goes. Taking a different path in today. This is the path I come out on. I just got a longer walk, but I think I'm going to hunt along the edge as I head east. Nice day, though. Look at it. No big giant waves. I like it. Just a little roly polies. But, you know, we'll probably get our little morning tsunami. I don't see no looters down there yet. I can see a long ways from up here. First target's at 12.10. I like 12.10. Most of the time. When I can get it out of the hole, then we got it on the third scooper. Oh, wonderful, wonderful. Look at that. A way to start the morning off. Gotta get out just about screen deep. I ain't quite got there yet. About another half a foot. Oops. Yep. Uh oh, there it is. 12, 19. Might as well leave the camera on. Not a very big target. That could be a good sound, a sign. Nah, it's too runny. Oh, I don't think I like it now. Stand by. That's why I didn't like it at the end. It was, didn't sound very good. Well, I stayed with that hole. It took me 10 more scoops to get it. That's what, what, that's what the sound was right there. 12.21 end up being. Well, we got a first quarter anyway. 25 cents. 12.12. Oh, I don't like it. 12.12. I'll just save that. For my pouchy, and on we go. Always a good sign. First piece of gray matter for today. I've dug two dimes since I saw you last. Look at that fat daddy gray matter. Five or six, six ounces of gray matter. God, that'll hold my pouch down anyway. Well, I got six scoops off this 12-12, and I haven't got it out yet. Make that seven scoops. Sounds good. I don't know what it's going to be. Maybe some deep gray matter. Come out of there, Chiquito. Sounds like we got it this time, though. Eight scoops. Oh, man. Man, man. I can't believe it. That's why I was a little scratchy. Look, number two. Cut. Tsunami, tsunami. Early today. But it's coming. 
crashing like the devil right over there. And you might be able to see it this morning since the sun is so bright. There's a Navy ship that just went by, so I'm thinking that's what it is, them big Navy ships. That's my buddy Rick from PA, AT Pro. I think the Mumbles Man is coming. I think the real guru is coming. I don't know about anybody else yet. I can't see the number, I just know it's a nice low tone. Well, I do know now whatever it was has fallen through my scoop. Not in the hole, it's on the right hand side, out on the lip. Yeah, now it's moved out even further. Stand by. I like gray matter. I like it as a good sign. Blingy thing. Huh? I said a dime and a blingy thing. I got uh, two dimes and uh, three sinkers and a quarter, I think. Right you might feel a lot of little fish nibbling on the hairs on your legs. <laughs> when you dig things out of the sand, they get the, uh, the sediment gets on your legs and they eat it off the hair of your legs. <laughs> Be three or three hundred around you sometimes. Little pompano they are. Goes the real guru at a fast pace. We're not quite to the hole. He wants to get there first. I don't blame him. 14. I don't know what it's going to be. 12, 14. Well, I'll tell you one thing, it's golden color. That's the total extent of it though. Golden color on one side, platinum on the other. 1215. Big, I can hear it clanging around in there. Oh, wonderful. Another prize from the deep. Stand by. Make sure you keep your coil on the sand, tight as you can get it. And investigate every little blip, even if it's not it sounds good. Just make you shake your foot over it. Or this stuff is deep and it makes funny sounds sometimes. Well, that knocked my head off at first. There's some iron in here too. That's what it was probably. Just follow what he's doing. Well, the big guy showed up. There's somebody down east of us. I don't know if it's Denny or maybe Eddie. There's a, that's Bobby's brother right there, Glenn. I don't know if you can see him or not. He's coming this way.
How are you making that now? <coughs> Iron's killing me. Trying to get the iron out of this thing. There's part of the hole right there, is it? Yeah. That might be Denny right there. I think it, the way he carries his scoop, it looks yeah, like. Yeah, it looks like Denny. Yeah. No more not seeing him. I'm going to make my way back to where, where we came in at, where you came in at. There's a few targets there. There's more targets there than it is here, but this has been a hot spot right here between them poles, the whole swimming beach. But yeah. there's been a few targets right where he is. Yeah, I'm just going to keep working that way. Yeah. Okay, I'll get up. Do you wife, your wife collect shells? Um, like that conch shell right there? Oh, no. No. Okay. <laughs> Away, that's a big one. I was gonna give it, put it in your truck if you want it. I guess it's the bottom of a light bulb or something. Forty-five. Here's another half a dollar, but I'm thinking a quarter. Stand by. Twelve fifteen. Stand by. I need one of them. I know. I I lost. Bring in the scoop. Finally. Got ice too. I think that's a blinger. Come in way high. One of them ones. Popcorn ring, I call it. Cracker Jack box ring. See what it reads. I can't even see it. Forty-two. Forty-four. Not yellow. But a ring, nonetheless. You got two what's it's three gray matters, two nickels, two quarters. But she was hot on dimes, three, six, eight dimes. One bullet and one bling with red icebergs. It's uh, eight o'clock now, I gotta take my truck to the shop at ten, get my navigation thing replaced. So no spin the day. And a bunch of eyes take back. It was a slow knife day yesterday. Twenty four blazes, all I did in four hours. I ain't complaining, that was it's okay day, but it's not a ripper. But I picked up a lot of knives, so I ended up having what did I have? 24 plus uh, 11 and 18. So I did okay. 
See you tomorrow. Back in the bay, I think. Gigmaster, he went to Nada. He dug a million targets, but no bling. I mean, no gold. No, and the Mobus man was down there with me, as you, you saw him off in the distance. I haven't talked to uh, my buddy Rick from Pennsylvania. See how he made out. He sends me a report. Must have been bleak for him, too. Okay, I'll see you.